What are they cooking? What is that? Yeah, let me open. Men don't open what people are cooking. Ooh, as you can see. So let's start with this mama and see how she is. So guys, before we go, this one is uh, like a utensil stand. No, so they use it like to hang things. Wow, guys, this is nice. We don't have these big stones like this. Mm -hmm. Welcome back to our YouTube channel. In case you're new, please subscribe, hit the like button, and press the notification bell so that every time I post a video, you're here to vibe with us. Guys, I'm back to the Mundari land because you guys asked me to give you more of the videos and the detailed homestead tour so this homestead is big and there are many activities that are being done here so i'm going to be moving around with you guys and learning new things with you i know by the time i came here i was like at a 50k subscriber or less i think yeah so i have more than 40k that are new so you guys are, are going to be seeing this place so let's start. this is a very beautiful place guys as you can see so let's start with this mama and see how she makes peanut butter is it peanut oh it's peanut Hello. so let me try guys we do this at our home so <laughs> Yeah, you are good, I mean. So you have to make sure it doesn't pour. How come it's not coming? <laughs> so yeah, this is peanut and uh, they first pound, they uh, grind it, no, roast it. After roasting, then they can pound it to make peanut butter, and it really looks nice. But they remove that red red cap on it, yeah. So to make peanuts, so come and show them the peanut butter. Yeah. <laughs> I hope I'm making it right. <laughs> <laughs> is it coming out nicely? It's nice. Mm. Uh, Guys, I've tested it. <laughs> wow, but it's not moving. <laughs> so guys let's continue with our home tour thank you all this thank you so guys that was how they make peanuts if you've ever wondered how they make peanuts that's how they make it so you come and we see this one is also a master another person also doing peanut here so guys before we go this one is uh, like a utensil stand no, so yeah. they use it like to hang things yeah, this is for even uh, to protect the goats from eating cassava yeah. or millet yeah. they put so it gum, here so gum yeah. okay so guys this is the african way of preserving things and protecting them from animals you see we africans are Brilliant. And then, ha, huh, this one is nice. What? It's like a party for these things. Everywhere, guys, you see. Everywhere, peanut factory. Peanut factory. Good at it. Wow. Oh. Uh. 
Come and see this one. Before I can knock it down. Let me try. Let me try this one. This one looks nice. Eh? Let me try. <laughs> you do for me also shots for you too. <laughs> Hmm. Wow, guys, this is nice. We don't have these big stones like this. Hmm. But by the come and by the time you finish here, I can be painting. <laughs> Thank you. So let me go and show you the motor. I've seen there are motor. So let me show you. The motor, and then now uh, I want to um, stick to us. I think before they start grinding them, they first pound them. See, this is a motor, guys. Yeah, this is a pistol and the motor. Yeah. Wow, let me do Wow. Yeah, but it looks very... Not dirty. <laughs> Seriously? <laughs> this is for making porridge, right? Yeah, porridge. So guys, this is made out of the wood. I think all of you guys know the the what the motor and the pistol. So it's used to pound like this. Pound. Can you do for us a short for TikTok? <laughs> and take some nice pictures. Yeah, <laughs> Yes, I'm I'm not English. I'm English. i I'm not English. i think she's experienced. We we do have motor and pistol in my village. But it's not this big and you know heavy. <laughs> they don't want to take it, they don't want to include this girl here. So, this girl is planning to come here, so they are planning to send her out. <laughs> that is it. You happen to say that you guys don't want her to be here. So <laughs> Okay, guys, so that was the one for pounding. So let's and, uh, hello. So we have like open kitchen here. What are they cooking? What is that? Yeah, let me open. Men don't open what people cook. Ooh, meat! Yeah. Wow, guys, there is meat here. Let me just. Oh, you want to see meat? Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> but why is it the meat is too dark like this? No, I don't know. Maybe it had blood. <laughs> so, guys, let's continue. Oh. This is like a bed. Is this a bed? Yeah, this is a bed. So, guys, there are open space. Yeah, open space beds. 
floating bed. You just come and sleep here. Oh, and it's strong. Eh? Yeah, strong. Ten, like, ten to fifteen people can sit here. Wow! Yes, they can sit. Like this, five can sit oh, here. Oh, sitting. Yeah, yeah, but sleeping is for two but people. Sleeping, maybe two. Uh, yeah, two actually. Yeah. So, guys, come. Let's go. We can go and see what they are cooking there. So, guys, there is open, open kitchen. Another open kitchen there. Are they making kisra or something? Do they eat kisra here? Yeah, of course they do eat. They are lot. They are good of them that can do for you good kisra either. Sure. Good one. We are going to ask them to give us kisra. Okay. Yeah. Have they done this right today? Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. I'll try to know. Oh. And what are the men doing there? Oh, it's time for. They meet very well and then they meet very well. Okay. So, guys, here in the African traditional home, we have duties for men, duties for female. So, if it's time for slaughtering a cow, it's always the men that do that. You will never find a woman slaughtering a cow. So, it's always the men that slaughter cows and then pass over the meat to the women to prepare it. So, the women will prepare it well and then they will serve it to their men. Even if it's a ceremony like this, today we have a ceremony here. So I'll tell you more about the ceremony later. But uh, if there's a ceremony, still the men will do their duty and the women will perform their duty too. So as you can see here, we are cooking meat. I hope it. It's okay. It's hot. Ooh, this is a too much meat. Guys, a lot of meat today. Wow, 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 wow. Wow, it's a lot of meat. Is it okay? Is it clean? Okay, put back. Wow. And then that is for what? For Kisra? That one, Kudra? Ah, that's Sida. A Sida? Yeah. Wow. So I'm going to do a video where I'm making a Sida. I guess rice. Rice? Rose? Ah, a Sida. But it has oil. A Sida here. Oh, yeah? Oil? 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 Kudra? Oil? 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 It has cooking so oil. Put it like this, so that it can oh it can be like stuff. nice. Not to have problem in the stomach. Alright. Yeah. So guys, let me finish up this video here and then now uh, I'll be showing you movies. So stay on this channel to learn more about the African traditional living fuel. I've ever wondered how do people live in the villages. I'm here to show you how people live in the villages. It's beautiful. Are you single? Are you single? How old are you? Are you King Anumura? King Anumura? Nana wa kamutasha. Fifteen years. Fifteen and she's taller than me like yeah. this. You see? Yeah. What? Fifteen years. She's not married. She's not married. Yeah. She's a Diana. Nande. She's single. Does she want a man? Doga ngurla le. Ngurla le nyo. Do I Gaima? Ijuba. No. Do I Muri Ijuba? I does. Uh, she doesn't like somebody eh? from Juba. So if she someone is going to marry her, how many cows do they? Do they Muri Gaima? Do do do. Yema tu muda. Unu mo. Muda mia. Yeah. One hundred. One hundred cows. What? So guys, a hundred cows for this beautiful girl? Yeah, then you can. Yeah, yeah. If you have a hundred, like okay, ask her that. Like, is it okay with her to marry um how they call a white person? Arita kido ruga yama umuri lupe. Lupe. Awaja chua nye luje wichu la lakutuka mia. Ah, now. That's why I imagine she's denying it. She doesn't want a white person. Yeah, he wants black man. So guys, unfortunately, if you're white, no way. They don't want white. They want black. 
<laughs> if you're black, prepare your 100 cows and you come for this beautiful young girl. <laughs> but you have to wait until she's 18. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. So that was it for the video and bye.